Yes, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Gold's Bible. Chelsea nail Southampton won full time. What a disappointment. What a disappointing result for Chelsea. James uh, Ward Prowse pinpoint free kick was enough for Southampton to claim the three points at Chelsea and piles more pressure on Graham Potter. The Saints, uh, they stay bottom with three points uh, separating themselves and safety. Chelsea, meanwhile, remain 10 points off of fourth, having played a game more than Newcastle. The pressure, I'm telling you, the pressure piles up on Potter. There can be no doubt uh, about that. Two wins now, two wins in 14 Premier League games. That is just incredible. And eight goals scored in 14 Premier League games. How can this be accepted by the Chelsea board? I don't know. And I think the time is running out for Graham Potter. And I think you could get sacked tonight, really. I mean, this is an incredible result. How could you lose a game at home against Southampton, which is a team that is placed to 20th? This is the worst team in the league by numbers. It's the worst team in the league. And somehow they lose at home. And did they create enough chance to win it? I don't think so. I don't think Chelsea deserves to win this game. Maybe you could say they could afford uh, to get a draw in this match. They had a couple of misses off the line clearance. Uh, one shot from Sterling got cleared off the line. But I don't remember a lot of chances being created for Chelsea in this match. And they're lacking in every department. I mean, the defense is not good. The middle of the park is not good. And out front, they can't score goals. It's clearly the manager's fault. It can't be this bad. I mean, all these players, they cannot be this bad. I'm telling you guys, because you can't have all 11 players playing bad. That's just points everything towards the manager. The manager needs to do more and he needs to do more and he needs to do it quickly because I don't think he has enough time. TikTok, TikTok is happening right now as we speak. He could get sacked tonight. I'm telling you, I don't wish that on anybody, but the way that Chelsea are going now, the, the results they're getting is just awful. Just awful. Let's just quickly uh, take a look at the updated version of the table here. So Arsenal stay top with 54 points. Man City drawn the game today, 52 points. United have a game tomorrow against Leicester City. Newcastle are placed fourth with 41 points. Looking at Chelsea, Chelsea sit 10th at the bottom, 31 points, 31 points. Now the gap between top four and them is 10 points. So can they make it? I, I, I highly doubt that now. I highly doubt that now. Look at Southampton. Even with a win, they still stay at the bottom of the league uh, with 18 points. So it just goes to show you how bad of a result this is and massive, massive disappointment. Uh, Grand Potter's definitely going to need Harry Potter to turn things around, in my opinion. But what do you guys think about this game? Let me know what you feel about this game. And who do you think should replace Thomas Tuchel if he gets the sack? And do you think Chelsea could finish in the top four? Let me know in the chat. Um, and also, who was your man of the match? I think man of the match, I wouldn't give it to any Chelsea player. I think they were all average, in my opinion. Prowse should get man of the match stunning free kick and that should be the difference between these two teams and i would give it to him but thanks for watching guys don't forget to smash a like on the video subscribe to the channel if you guys are new and i'll see you on the next one peace